We waited to bestow this golden apple where many students at Gulf Shores High School like to hang out when they have some downtime. Coach Austin Boyd's art classroom. And you can see they take art seriously here. But I coach soccer, basketball. I'm currently coaching him in baseball, okay. football. I've been with Coach Hud uh, on the ball. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. So right. I do a little bit of everything. Usually the so. coaches like teach history or right. drivers, drivers ed, ed or right. something. Right. Yes, sir. But he's got a serious art gene. Along with everyday art lessons, Boyd and his students have gained a bit of notoriety by producing portraits of famous people, some who have taken notice. About 12 years ago, a couple students found a new technique that an Austrian artist uh, started called spontaneous realism. And it was more like paint by numbers for us older people. And so it's an easier technique for the kids to learn how to paint portraits. And Boyd decided that some of his subjects might enjoy seeing the artwork he and his students produced. I've done like President Obama, I've done President Trump, Melania, I've done, uh, as you can see right there, there's a couple here. I've done Dabo Sweeney, I got to go meet him and hang out with him, and Coach K at Duke. His artwork has resulted in some decent perks, from autographs from the Red Hot Chili Peppers. They all signed it. Of course, they called me when I was on my bus route, so I couldn't go and meet him. Oh yeah, Boyd drives a bus too. But he's been able to take students on a tour of the White House and a tour of the Duke campus with Coach K and tickets to a game. And by now, you might be realizing why hanging out in Coach Boyd's classroom is one of the cool things to do. Well, he's a great teacher, and he helps me whenever I need help, and he's funny to talk to. He's always, like, there for us, and whenever we need to talk about something, we can always go to Coach Boyd, and he's my favorite teacher. Our congratulations to Coach Austin Boyd and Gulf Shores High School for a job well done. Bill Riles, WKRG News 5.